break. If you're looking to buy or sell your house, you are far from alone. The housing market is hot right now in Indiana. News 8's Hannah Mordo dug into why some homes are selling within hours, and a broker you talked to said it's because of the pandemic. That's right. Realtors say the pandemic has really created a perfect storm of low interest rates, low supply of houses here in Indiana, and a lot of people who are stuck at home wanting their next perfect house. For sale, sold. The signs around the state are a sign of the times. It's a huge change. A change people like Trent Vanneman are taking advantage of. This is his new house. Very happy that we were able to make this move. With the pandemic, he's been working from home and his fiance, an overnight shift nurse, sleeps during the day. So their small house in Broad Ripple wasn't cutting it. And while they weren't planning to move, the pandemic canceled their wedding and changed their housing needs. You have to have your own space or Everyone starts to go a little crazy. Houses are selling sometimes within hours. Christy Snap, a realtor with Remax's Indie Scene team, says more people are looking for homes with offices, extra living space, and outdoor amenities. But the demand in Indiana is outweighing the supply. We have 0.9 months worth of inventory right now, meaning if nobody else listed their home right now, we would run out of inventory in less than a month. That's not all. Add in the record low interest rates sparked by the health crisis. You have more renters wanting to buy, buyers getting more house for a lower mortgage, and more current homeowners refinancing to save money and then staying put. Sort of a perfect storm of a lot of buyers, low inventory. Ever seen anything like this? No, honestly, I mean, it's kind of a perfect storm. Jason Krause is a broker at Remax Advanced Realty and says this is an all-time seller's market. It's going to go so quickly. Meaning buyers have to move fast. So not only do you need to be able to put forward a strong offer, but you need to be pre-approved and ready to buy. A word of caution, though. Realtors say this market could change next year when the CARES Act mortgage forbearance ends. So we may see an uptick in foreclosures and or people needing to move. While the pandemic means a lot of unknowns for the future. Now we're spending a lot more time at home. Trent says looking for the silver lining can go a long way. You have to figure out how to keep moving forward and make a positive out of it. These realtors say the health crisis has also caused them to do more virtual home visits, which is speeding up the whole process, too. Hannah Mordeaux, Wish TV, WishTV.com, and follow us on Facebook. Interesting, Hannah. Thanks. It's